Welcome back to Denforflux. Today we have an exciting project in store for you. We are going to explore home automation using an ESP8266 and set up a web server to control various devices in our home. I have connected four LEDs as a prototype. You can also use relays instead of these LEDs. The Wi-Fi module NodeMCU ESP8266 will receive commands from the smartphone and also from the web dashboard and turn on and off LEDs. So let's dive right in. We will require the following components for this project ESP8266, LEDs, breadboard, jumper wires. The ESP8266 is a versatile and affordable Wi Fi module that can be programmed to interact with different sensors and devices. Today, we will be using it to create a web server that allows us to control our home appliances remotely without any manual switches. Connect the anode of the LEDs with digital pin D2, D3, D4 and D5 respectively. Connect the cathode with the ground. Once everything is wired up, power up ESP8266 and connect to the Wi-Fi network. It creates. Make sure that the laptop and ESP8266 are connected with the same Wi-Fi. Open a web browser and enter the IP address displayed on the serial monitor. Copy the IP address. and paste it in the web browser. You will be greeted by a user-friendly web interface to control your devices. Now you can turn on and off the LEDs by clicking the button. When we will click on the button, we will get the message that the LED is turned on. And when we will turn off the button, we will get the message LED is turned off. You can also control the LEDs from the mobile by entering the IP address in the mobile. Now you can control the LEDs. That's it for today's tutorial. I hope you found this project exciting and useful. If you have any questions and or suggestions, please leave them in comments below. Don't forget to like this video, subscribe to our channel and hit the notification bell to stay updated with our latest projects. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video.